The creative idea behind the project with the casino is completely to do with motion, movement, and how we can challenge the way that people sit. Everything happens around the dining table now. You, you eat, you socialise, you work, and so we wanted to design a chair that could address all of those different ways of working and sitting and eating yeah. and so on. The dining chair has been associated with this kind of formality from even when you were a child and your parents tell you to sit up and eat properly. And today I think we can challenge that by doing something which is less formal, something that's more playful and has a bit more joy to it. Movement, joyful and round. It's much more fun to be moving while you're seated, otherwise you, you fall asleep and um, conversation is more interesting when you're moving. Joyful, because I think the world needs that right now. I think there's a lot of, we're, we're in a world with challenges and I think actually if there's one thing that design can do is to inject a bit of joy back into the world. Why round? Because if it wasn't round, it wouldn't rotate very well. My uncle it was the person who made me look and see what was going on in the world, observe buildings, nature. He really opened my eyes from a very young age. I think probably it was a time and a place that I found most inspiring, and I'd say it was the feeling that London had in the mid 80s. And um, there was something about the energy of London at that time that I found incredibly inspiring in my career. When we were selected to design the Olympic torch for the London 2012 Games, that was a real high point because it was the first time we'd ever designed something that would have a truly uh, global reach. It became a public thing. Mm -hmm. It's not something that people chose to buy. People had it and it had to represent everybody. It's true, that was quite a good moment. Yeah, so there you go. Yeah, it was a good one. Double answer. That was a good one.